Hello, I'm Pam Archer from Pamela's Event Design. Now, I love to do floral design, and I love to show others things that they can do for uh, around the house. You might be surprised what you might have growing in your backyard that you could use as a centerpiece. Maybe you're having an outdoor barbecue or something just uh, quick that you want to put on the table and you don't have time to run out to buy flowers, fresh flowers. So uh, I went out to my backyard just to see what I have. And I have some hosta. So I cut some hosta leaves. And I'm just going to put these around, just make a little bed of greenery right here uh, to put in my vase. You can use any kind of container. And remember that teapots and teacups and things like that make great containers. So all the way around, just like that, clipping and trimming, however the height, the, whatever the height that I want them to be, like so. And then I'm going to come back in and take some fresh flowers. This is an Ostromeria. Some people call them Peruvian lilies. And you want to always remove any foliage that's going to fall below the water line. So I'm taking that loose, make a little quick diagonal cut and just laying that right down inside the container. I'm just laying it against the foliage there. And this is some lantana. It was a potted plant or a plant that I bought uh, to put in my planter this year. So I'm add a little bit of that. You can tell uh, by now that I love pink. So everything in my yard this year was in shades of pink and yellow. So just trim a little bit off that adding it. There's no set way how to design flowers. There used to be, but uh, we don't really follow those guidelines so much anymore. It's pretty much just whatever you decide to do and, and your, what you like in your design. Now, I also grew some zinnias just from seed. Now, zinnias don't last a long time as cut flowers, but they certainly do add a nice little pop of color for short term. It's going to add some little zinnias in here. Now, if you want to know about my secret flower solution, you'll have to go back and watch the video about uh, preserving hydrangea and get that little solution because it's great for all flowers. Just pulling the bottom leaves off, flipping it to the length that I want it, and there. I have a nice little centerpiece for my table for my guests. Now, you can do it, too. I know you can. I'm Pam Archer for Boomer Diva TV. Thank you for watching.